As always guys, giveaways at the end of the video from boosterchades.com. Stick around to the end to see how to win. What's up guys, welcome to uh, Dotson build episode 13. Um, today we're going to be installing a stage three spec clutch, a short throw shifter. As well, we're gonna be plumbing some new fuel lines, putting in that uh, new fuel pump and uh, attaching some AN fittings to the end of the hard lines. Yep, that way we can run steel braided in the engine bay. Um, we're just gonna get started on all this. Let's do it. Okay, the first thing we're gonna do is swap out the stock fuel pump with the Walboro 255, and then we're gonna plumb the lines from here. Okay, so the car is all soft and hard lines. Uh, this one uses like a uh, little disconnect thing here. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna go soft to hard and then we're gonna put AN fittings on this. And then in the engine bay, we'll use uh, steel braided. There's just straight sand in it. That's the fuel filter, right? Yeah, fuel filter just filled with mud. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, that's, that's good. Pretty sure we can reuse this, right? Yeah, the car's gonna run on sand. Yeah. Quality sounds uh There's so much rust in there. Oh gross. Yeah, it's pretty fucked up. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> the sawzall looks like it's covered in doo doo. That's it. Alright, so JP ran out for some essentials. While he was doing that, I managed to get all of the hard lines out from under the car. Now we just gotta bend some more. Oh, damn. It's getting there. It's gonna take a while, but it'll get there. Devin's Picasso with the pipe bender. I'm trying to be. Oh, you're an expert in all things pipe, though, so. Yeah, that's my specialty. You a pipe spurt, bro? Yep. All right, so we're about to attach an AN fitting to the end of the uh, steel line that's going to connect to the braided. First, you got the sleeve that just slips right over. Then you got this little compression fitting. It goes right in there. And then there's the connector, which has a lip, bottoms out in there. Screw it up. There it is. And this is so we can run uh, steel braided in the engine bay, which is cleaner, safer, and whatever. Yeah, all those things. Yeah. There you go. Okay, up next down the up next to you <laughs> Up next on the to-do list. I'm gonna stick this thing back in there. Soul T5, world class T5. It is the world class model. Fuck out of my way, bro. Oh, that's rude. And we're gonna install this short throw shifter. Cause why not? Part of the transmission is the new clutch. Obviously, we didn't want to use a stock clutch. Our clutch of choice is the uh, spec stage three or stage four. I don't know. I forgot. It's it's better than stock. That's all that matters. It doesn't just come off. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah. Grabbing the mallets. Yep, mallets. The screwdriver. This seemed pretty easy. Oh, God. Oh, Devin. Get something for that. What? Don't, don't just record, bro. Get something for it. <laughs> Making me do shit all the time. Got him, 
in the container. Do you want the whole thing? What? No. That more is just gonna pour out when I put this back down. There you go, buddy. You fucking suck. You don't want my help, bro? I'm pretty sure. Hold on. Yeah, let me go check this out. I'm pretty sure if you just grab it and pull it, <laughs> and pull it off. Oh, is that it? <laughs> yeah. It got me. Yeah. I mean, it defeated you, but I, I came in. Yeah, you're, yeah. You're the ultimate champion. Yep. You see that paper towel work there? Look at that. Cleaning up your messes and fixing it. All right, so we're about to put in the uh, pilot bearing. This yeah. little guy. Yeah, this little thing. There's a little rubber seal in there. You want to make sure that faces the clutch because that'll keep all the clutch dust out of there. It's usually a fairly tight fit, and these aren't that easy to get out or get back in. That sounds like it's bottomed out. Yeah. Good. Cool. So this thing can go back in there. Sweet. Finally putting the transmission back in. So this video we got our fuel system and the transmission done. Next up we're gonna have to do uh, injectors, the steel rated lines, and the intake. And after some electrical crap, it should be ready to go. Electrical crap. Yeah. Alright guys, it's going to wrap it up for this video. We still have a ton of details to sort out, but we're slowly chipping away at it. Um, for those of you who are new here, we give away products from BoostedChads.com at the end of every video. Right now, Devin's going to go ahead and pick this video's uh, winner. <laughs> yeah, I, I forgot what we were doing. Oh yeah, you're picking the winner. <laughs> yeah, picking the winner. All right, this week's video winner is Sam Smith. Okay, Sam Smith, contact us at teamboosted at boostedshades.com or through any of our social media accounts and we'll get back to you and ship you your prize. To win, uh, to win the giveaways, all you have to do is like the video if you actually liked it, subscribe to the channel, and uh, answer a question we have for you at the end of the video. So this week's question is, what's your next modification or project that you're doing with your car? Obviously we have a whole bunch. We want to know what you have coming up. All right guys, that's going to do it for this video. Uh, remember to like and subscribe and we'll see you next time. See you guys next time. I can't say see you next time. I already said see you next time. Peace bitches.